Alright guys, it's 422 today. And it's Friday and it's that time that I've been looking for all week. I love Fridays. I love having my time off. I seriously need to look at my calendar and decide which month am I going to take my one week off. Yep. Or even two weeks. I don't know. But regardless, you'll be well deserved taking time off out of this place. When you're working with the public, they don't have no mercy on you. They will take as much as they can and suck as much as they can out of you. The more you give, the more that they want. would say that I've been burning my candles at both ends now for over two months trying to get those numbers in the sales trying to show your company and your managers that you're doing well it's like I just said the more you give the more they want it's better for you it's better for you to find a happy medium and stick with it. So before I continue with this, I want to say thank you to all of my subscribers and to those people just visiting my channel for the first time. If you see something in my channel, conversation, topics, anything, personal situation, if that resonates with you, please consider on subscribing. I'll be right back with more. I'm not suggesting anything so complicated. only leave early on Thursdays because Thursdays I leave home one hour early they don't pay us for 40 hours they pay us for 39 hours like that if there's an overage over the week that hour that you leave early once a week will absorb those time that you would have had overtime my company doesn't do overtime they don't pay for overtime so they give everybody a, a 39 hours, but you get to go home one hour early every week. So there have been days every week that I'm staying over because I have late walk-ins. People want to submit orders. These are not your regular customers that you have or regular accounts. They're just walk-ins from the street that could turn into an account if they're working on a large project or if they have a small business and they're doing a large order 
and if they don't have a pro account you can offer that to them but these are the guys and the customers that causes me to build up time that I have to cut so today I'm cutting an hour overtime but actually I worked 10 to 15 minutes over when I should have left so all I'm cutting is about 45 minutes So I have a new supervisor because they fired the old one that was here. I don't mean old literally, I'm just saying when I transferred here, he was here already, his name was Jay. I never had a problem with Jay. Jay was okay, but not to some of the managers. So they let him go. The new guy is named Robert. He's okay, he's a good guy, easy to talk to works very hard Jay did as well so I've been staying a lot while he goes home early today I told him I had to cut an hour and he tried to talk me into staying till my regular time even though I need to cut time he said to me come on make us some money you have a chance to get overtime pay the company doesn't pay you or want you to work overtime. Doesn't he realize that I got that I was over hours because I was staying over? And the amount of staying over that I stayed over, isn't that enough? Apparently not. So I'm going to go home, I'm going to unwind, I'm going to go to my special room, get really comfortable and just lay back, kick back, and that's it. Um, I was going to buy some uh, cactus plants to plant on the outside of my house in the front. I think that would have been a great addition to plant those cactuses sporadically on the right side of my home. I still might come in here tomorrow morning and grab a few. We'll see how I feel tomorrow. I'm almost home guys and if I decide to do a little bit a little project tomorrow very little, little very small little project little fun stuff nothing major nothing heavy nothing complicated if I decide to do that I'll videotape it and I'll share it with you guys but for now I'll say hope you guys have a nice evening and I'll see you guys soon perhaps tomorrow <laughs>